There we go. We should be back up now. Hello. Stop panicking. Yep. We're okay. Hello. We're back up. Yep. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, yeah. guys. Is that one? Is the one I see there? Is that the one that's on? That's what's broadcasting. Yeah. Right, so Can we do left wide? Yeah, of course. Oh, hold on. Sorry. Apparently not. Yes. There, there you go. go. Hey, I just wanted to say hi to Tim Schaefer, who's apparently watching us right now. Hello, Tim. Hi, hi Tim. Tw Twenty-six minutes, and you're I'll on. I'll just check to see if I have Tim's contact. I do have Tim's. He already contacted us. Oh, with oh getting a lot of love, Tim, on the uh, IRC channel. The, hey, Tim. The, I can IRC. I can just pretend it's for crash me, ratio but it is. Oh, it's that's right. Oh, My name is Tim, that, so, so I can so pretend it's for me. Oh, okay. I know it's not for me. Two points. Two points. Oh man, Tim, you're getting a lot of have my baby. Apparently, people want to have your baby, Tim. Psychonauts 2, apparently. Yes, actually, it is well known that people want Psychonauts 2 to both Tim and to me. We, we do know that. And how many hours in are we? That's Tim is double fine. Yes, he is. Well, there are other people that work there, too. <laughs> and nobody but the face of the company. Right? That sounds right, right James. 1634. For More stacking. What a good idea. That's a good idea. Uh, what else do we have here? Grim Fandango 2. Yeah. Oh, Absolutely. Yeah. That oh. would be awesome, right? How awesome oh, would that be? Psychonauts 2, please? Yeah, that was already... Favorite PC game from the 90s? Uh, probably Torment. Mm -hmm. Torment. Planescape Torment. That was a good game. I'd say Anachronox, but it was like 2001, right? So... I but think yeah, the Torment. Planescape Man, was just... We are looking pretty good. It was. It was the writing. Really the Starcraft, We're personally. looking pretty good. Starcraft, Starcraft was personally. a good game. I was a big still, we haven't right. That's more fun, but anything? yeah, and this was more story Does, does it look like you're Colin McComb, the uh, the guy that was the writer on Torment, is... He just did a Kickstarter for a new book called Oathbreaker, which I chipped into. And Oathbreaker, check it out. It's on Kickstarter, Oathbreaker, from the people that brought you, or one of the people that brought you, Planescape Torment. Do you know if it has a website? Is it like Oathbreaker.com or something? Sorry? pretty damn good, though. Do you know if they have a website? Like. We're it basically on the same curve as we were last year, but just... I'll use, my, I'll use my iPad powers here and try to tell you. <laughs> like, but I love how Oathbreaker, we're, like, Oathbreaker, above uh, yeah, the first if you go, year, though. I'll, I'll dig it up. Give me a sec. Significant. Uh, yeah. Hey, 33,000 even. Woo! Thank you. Somebody did that intentionally. Oh, yeah. Nice. Let's see how long that lasts. Yeah. Oathbreaker, The Knight's Tale, Fantasy by Colin McComb. Is it... It's, so it's one word, Oath? Oathbreaker, yeah, it's on Kickstarter. I'm just looking to see if there's uh, Oath with an A, of course. He was trying to raise uh, 1,500 <laughs> and he raised 2,700, so that was cool. Dear Doctor Lur, what's your favorite map proje projection? That uh, that kind of blew my mind when I found yeah, that. Yeah, yeah, well, I, I I heard about I'd sort of heard about it before, and um, somebody linked to that. Uh, that there's like a a, ch a clip from The West Wing, where these guys like demonstrate the. It's switching to a different map projection, like and just how off the standard map projection is, with like the sizes of like Greenland yeah, versus yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> things. So it's cool. I yeah. I don't know if I really have a favorite map projection. Well, different ones are used for different things, right? I mean, yeah. some are for direction, some are for area. So it really depend on what. You yeah, I think do. it's the. Yeah, I think the one thing I was really saying it's like it's fundamentally impossible to map a sphere yeah. to a flat object perfectly. Yeah. So. You're when Daniel stuck. gets back, I'm definitely pawning this thing off on him for a Pikachu. Hour. Someone, uh, someone's a uh, well, he needs to Pokemon fan out there. Dr. Exactly. James. Dear Dr. Sam, seriously, I, I'm i not actually that awesome. I just look awesome on TV. <laughs> no, actually, you know what? I, we have a special filter that we have. Yeah. That, an awesome filter. No, we I've just come awesome. out of a period of a long period of life where I was not that awesome, so I just look good by comparison to that. I'm not actually. Oh, I see. You know what I mean? Well, I mean, that, that's, that, that awesome. can be a stylistic choice in life, you know? That's right. Really mess up for a long time, and then you just, hey, I'm not messing up anymore. Wow, dude, <laughs> yeah. awesome. Good relationship strategy as well. Sopa. Yeah, people <laughs> no. keep asking me about Sopa. I don't know. I I mean, I'm not a big fan of it as it currently stands. I I don't like weighing in with giant. Uh, I haven't I haven't read it. I haven't done enough reading on it to make a, a pronouncement. But uh, it doesn't pass the Steve smell test so far, and makes me extremely nervous. So, um, so so far so bad. Maybe is a good way to say it. Mm. Tim, have you done a song yet? No. No. Oh. <laughs> Sorry? I asked Tim if he had done a song yet. I only just yet. got here no, like Tim just 15 got minutes here. ago. I'm not awesome, but I play. What's working with Nuka Break like? Nuka Break was fun. It was a neat little project um, with uh, Zach and, well, a lot of amazing people. Vince Talenti, who's an amazing director. Um, Aaron Moorhead, who did the, the, the director of photography. And they had like some cool names on it. Like Doug Jones was on it. That was really cool. Got to hang out with Doug Jones. Some really, and it was all basically 
you know, shoestring volunteer labor of love. It was really cool, man. There's a bunch of uh, pictures on the Megacynics website of that too, if you want to go look for it. Tim Schaefer needs more love. I agree with you. Tim Schaefer needs more love, man. Everybody needs Someone's more love. Someone's asking for intros around the room. Mm. Oh, they just dropped in. Viewers. Do we do a clockwise thing? Uh, we'll start with the driver. All right, I'll well, start, yeah, start with the driver. I'm James. I've been driving for Hi. a long time. I'm Tim. I'm Ashley. I'm Crows. Yo. Pika. I'm Matt. <laughs> Matt. I'm Kurt from Team Four Star. Hi. Voice actor. Voice actor. Yeah. Voice actor. Yeah. Voice actor. Really early for that. <laughs> <laughs> Steve Dangler, Megacynix, Strigogen, all kinds of stuff. And I'm Paul. And Johnny is hiding. And I'm Johnny. Here. In the control oh. booth. Curiously wondering what the desert bus screen looks like. Well, you could check it out bus on cam. the bus There's cam. There's a bus yeah. cam. Yep. Yeah. Well, I think they're wondering the screen, which they're playing it on, looks like. Um, we're hearing hey. you complaining all morning, so I, 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 I did, but I will, I will eat more. more. I feel like uh, uh, Johnny, <laughs> is there any way of giving sister. them a Hooray. show sister. of My all sister. this easily yeah. or no? Uh, your doctor yes, we have to, if we pull that camera, the different driver camera off. Yep, so I could do that. Binary, seriously? <laughs> do we have enough <laughs> Fireware slack? Uh, Come on, we need hex, not binary. Give me hex. <laughs> Let's see what binary, give me this binary stuff. So, what is it? Paul, can you go here to control the camera? Give me hex. go here to grab the camera. All right, we're just going to give you a view of what we can see. <laughs> yeah, what we've been looking at for the last uh, 16 and a half hours. Oh, yeah. We're going to try to show you what we are doing. Actually, that's a good point. We should right, let me know bang off a few pictures. Gonna, is that going to reach? Is the biggest problem is the there, um, I've seen a couple of people calling me Dr. Tim, and I think I may be the only person in the room who's not a doctor. I'm actually just a master, because I finished my master's degree. So, you know, I'm, I'm the one exception. All right, so. Okay, so everybody quiet down for a second. So this is what we have been looking at and will continue to look at for many, many more days. Me. So here is the uh, command center where we uh, actually run the feed. You can see, uh, you can see here, and you can see me Ooh. on there. Woo! Uh, and then this is where you guys are. Hopefully, we can see that. Yeah. <laughs> see, this is how we read where you guys are. It's all on a big flat screen TV. Uh, behind Paul is the soundboard, and. So, we have the soundboard over here, and we have the document scanner over here. And then we have that computer there, which is doing our chatting and our YouTubing and all that good stuff. Which you actually can see. And then over here, which might be very difficult, is... There we go. There's the Sega CD. There's the TV. There's the VCR. So we're not faking anything. Yeah. This is really happening. It's all the real deal. And you can see back at the back of the room, that's the... Crow's Ashton nest back Oh, can there. you actually? Uh, down a little bit. Kind of. And in fact, if you go up, you can see our bamboo pole. Yep, there's our... There's our bamboo pole. Yep. <laughs> and it's kind of hard to see, but up there as well, there is a camera. There's a camera. And there's actually another microphone up there, too, that's pointing. And that's the Crashton, uh, Crashton mic. cam. And mic, yeah. Crow's nest. All no, right. no, it's the Crashton cam that points yeah. at the Crow's nest. The Minecraft oh. block is not to scale. Uh, <laughs> No, it there probably isn't. We said it's about half scale. Probably right. Yeah, let's see about half scale. And see, like, yeah, the bamboo pole. Love that tape over the controller cable. Um, yeah, man. We uh, we've we've run into that problem, into that problem way too many times. We're smarter about that. Uh, to the person asking what the logo on my hat is, it's a it's an alternate logo for the Vancouver Canucks, <laughs> which is a great hockey team. Are there parts of the world where you have people don't know what hockey Another is? Another alternate logo for a burning car on fire. <laughs> yeah. Vancouver riots. Oh, yeah, that's dumb. <laughs> that was dumb. Global black eye. Just a little bit of a problem. <laughs> yeah. Do you derive any enjoyment from the bus at this point? No. <laughs> My soul is dead in black. Not really. Yeah, I just. I think you know, even at the beginning, it's kind of like ironic joy. Yeah, it, it's always like, oh, I remember this. This is not fun, but oh well. And I just, it's the twenty-four hour shifts. Like when we started five, four years ago, we did four hour shifts, and we alternated. We had four drivers and four hour shifts. Bless you. 
Uh, and like, thinking back, that is just a cakewalk. Like four hours now is just insane. But the last this year and the last year we started doing the twenty four hour shifts, just to really make it interesting for ourselves. So it's yeah, it's hard. I hit a wall at about six o'clock this morning. Now I'm good again. So I'll probably hit another wall pretty soon. Referring to chat, there we go. Also, there's many. Sorry, people right now, the IRC chat is blocked, so we can't really see what yeah, you're saying. Kind of Sorry. Um, just Canuck Canuck sounds like a slur for Canadian. Yes, it is. It is, it is. It is. It is indeed. Well, it's not really a slur. Oh, a slur, yeah. No. It never really had Short a form? It was a comic book uh, around the time of the Second World War. It was called Captain... No, it was Captain later than that. Captain Canuck. Canuck. Yeah. It was not a bad thing. Captain Canuck. Captain Canuck is actually awesome for Canadian. Yes, it is, Olafon. Very good. There you go. Quick while they can't see us. Yes. Yeah, it's, it's kind of like. Ash is awesome. We got an Ash like, is awesome. Yay. The Vancouver Canucks is kind of like you the New York taste. Yankees, but for Canada. Yeah. Awesome. Okay, yeah. I'll give you that. Basically. Hey. Sweet. Captain Canuck counterpart to Captain America. I think they're actually uh, brothers. <laughs> or cousins, maybe. Yeah. Hey. Hi. 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 Everybody in the room should speak oh, French for yeah. three minutes. I don't know if everyone would no. uh, uh, three minutes. It would, it would, all be, it would all just be bonjour, je m'appelle. I can speak decent French. Actually, that's a good. Who I can speak a few decent French? God damn it. Well, you know what? That's I not bad. I can to speak decent French. I have two diplomas. Oh, well, that's French and an English. Oh well, there you go. So you can speak excellent French. Mm -hmm. Yep. French, French immersion. The cadre program. Doctor Ler and Tim. Please explain in your own words why Paul has awesome eyebrows. <laughs> well, answering why Paul has awesome eyebrows is a very interesting question. Paul has awesome eyebrows, you know, presumably because oh his, his parents or his parents' parents oh, yeah. had awesome eyebrows. Did you bring pancakes? We just got a pancake oh, delivery. You were like hero right now. There's a lot of McDonald's pancakes. <laughs> Show them your wares. It's only eight orders. It kind of actually so blew their minds. <laughs> uh, you, I should put them upstairs. Oh, okay. okay. So anyone who wants pancakes, you can go upstairs. Pancakes! Why would you do that? It took me like tw 20 seconds to tie the shoelace. <laughs> Boss! 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 Girls used to do this to me in elementary school, too. So I burned their house down. 15 minutes to Tim. Tim Schaefer. Yep. Dear Dr. Lur, Captain Canuck is not a Marvel character. Yes, that is true. It's not a Marvel character. We, we do know that. Although Puck is Puck. also a Canadian superstar. Yeah. And ah. Captain Canada is mm. a Marvel superstar. That's true, yes. Who was a member of Alpha Force. Yeah. Um, Alpha Force this? just recently came back in the comics. Yeah. Bringing it back. Yep. Who owns Captain Canuck? Marvel. I think. Marvel. Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Canada doesn't do Marvel oh, yes, comics. Do 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 do. Look at this stuff, man. <laughs> How many people from Cardiff, Wales, in the chat? I don't. Let Doctor Steve do. drive for 15 minutes. Well, I'm gonna I'm gonna talk with Tim when he calls in at. Um, at 11, yeah, but after that, I'm, I'm right. totally down for driving yeah, the bus. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. How do you yeah, know, Dr. Steve, how do you know? Come to know so many huge names. I, uh, a long time ago, I just started um, collecting, uh, them? collecting them <laughs> and then sort of contacting them. But more recently, it's because I've actually gotten involved with financing projects and things like that, which sort of gets you... Uh, a name in the industry. If so. you have money to give to people, then they will come to you looking for that. Yeah, money. well, no, <laughs> actually, uh, if they have a good idea and you have the funding, right. everyone wins. Yeah, I, I mean, Tim, I, I approached him. I mean, he was sort of really? joking about funding for, for something, and, and uh, we sort of, it was actually on Twitter, and I said, well, no, seriously, if you need funding for it, we started talking, and I'm an old fan with well, money, lucky so for there him, then. <laughs> click, work perfectly. So, just little by little, I guess, is the, the uh, short version. You're the best kind of wealthy man. Uh. <laughs> Shout oh. out Steve's name is Ghost yeah. Nepa. What, what is what, how do you, how do you fully, how do you fully pronounce your name properly? Steven Dear Doctor Steve's sister Ash, hang on, hang do on, you Steve, find Steve, this crazy? All right, Steve Dangler, give me your money. <laughs> <laughs> you have all the money. Someone just asked him. <laughs> He's the one percent. Get him. Damn you! Yeah. <laughs> Actually, I don't. We must yeah, kill I'm him. Probably, I probably am the one percent, but I'm I'm not a. <laughs> Dick. You're not I mean, not. Sorry, I'm not allowed to say like that. that. Dragon shout. Uh, dragon shout. What's a dragon shout? That's not uh, Skyrim. Uh, oh, yeah. I'm just. I haven't played yeah. Skyrim. Yet. I have kids. No, the dragon. The dragon shout for Desert Bus is Wargar Bull. Wargar Bull. Yeah. 
Wire Garble! There it is. Oh, should have known about that. <laughs> Oh, sorry. <laughs> sorry for the levels, folks, if I blew your ears out. Yeah. You just blew their minds, man. <laughs> Every time Shaper game, Brutal Legend. Oh, Brutal Legend's pretty good. I, Psychonauts is awesome. I, this is one of the few games I've actually played three times through. And did you do, did you go for completion on those? Uh, yeah, I tried to go for completion. It, 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 it was just it was just a lot of I just 